tardes. El día de hoy estamos en una aldea africana. Acá tenemos el, el líder de la aldea, se llama Masai. La aldea nos va a estar mostrando un poco de cómo es la vida por acá, de sus tradiciones, de su cultura, de cómo empezó todo. Y vamos a ver qué tal todo esto. Todos tienen sus trajes típicos. Y nos van a mostrar ahorita un baile típico de esta, de esta aldea. Hello, how are you? ¡Qué recibida! Bueno, aquí están las casitas muchas de barro Miren, está súper grande esta aldea, la verdad no pensé que sería tan grande. Tienen unas casitas súper chiquitas, bajitas. Wow. Hello, thank you. Yeah. What do you want? That's how I know how to say. Yeah. What do you want? Okay. Stay here. No going back. <laughs> also, we usually bless their body ladies to have children. And also, they have their own songs to, to press their body. Okay. They, they, they believe uh, their God can exist. So we can see the men's dance. Okay. And that's how the mass men impress the ladies. Yeah. Oh, interesting. All right. Okay. Um, so before we do the fire, I'd like to 
I have brought you about a song. Okay. So the first song I told you earlier, it's a welcome song. The welcome so, song, yeah? Yeah, so the one we did for you, both ladies and some men. So that's okay. a welcome song. That's how we let you to feel at home or you're from home. So mm -hmm. you can now do whatever you want if you want to stay on it with us and then you can feel free. Okay. So uh, the other song I told you for the lady it was a blessing. A blessing. Why for the men. The other song is for the competition. Is it to see who jumps higher? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. So whenever you do jump higher than everybody, yeah. then uh, you get a free wife without being any cow. But that's how we you comp we compete for girlfriend. I think Interesting. Yeah. So how many wives can a man have? Many. Many. He like. Okay. Yeah. So we're gonna show you the fire making and the fire we do with the wood. No oh wow. No, because yeah, because you gotta see the whole. Wow. Oh. Oh. What's the name? Yeah. Canada. <laughs> All of it. All of it. Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, that's cool. And then you can cook with that. Yeah. Now wait, I'm on. Your name is Nicholas. Yes. Nicholas. 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 Hello. How are you doing? Okay, we're going to see you in a house. We're going to get some pollitos. Okay. okay. So this is your living room, kitchen. Yeah. How many uh, people live in a house like this? Like ten people. Ten people. Ten wow. people. Five. And uh, and you share? Oh, there's rooms yeah, there. Yeah, we have more rooms. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. In every house, okay. must have three rooms. Three rooms. Three rooms. One oh, for wow. the family, one for the children, as well for the guests. Okay. Actually. From outside, it looks like small, and then inside, it's like, yeah, whoa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, yeah. Interesting. Is there a reason why the windows are so small? Yeah, yeah, because of the those kind of dangerous animals. Oh. So we don't put them more open. And also, that's only a small space that we allow the smoke go outside. Oh. Because we light fire there. So the windows just by the kitchen, and then no more windows? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Interesting. Yeah. Miren, oh. esta es la cama. The back yeah. <laughs> the whole quarter of the house. Interesting. Many, many, many. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. yeah. Visitors? Many, Is many. he common? And also, once you have like a friend like me, you come through him, uh -huh. then you become so uh, very, very free. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you can good, like, good. stay a night, two nights, and then you experience the Maasai people. The life. Maasai culture, yeah. Yeah. That's you cool. do what all Maasai ladies do. Mm -hmm. And then you're milking cows, you go to the river. <laughs> nice, oh, water, that's yeah. a cool experience. Yeah. That is a very cool experience. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I wish stay. we would have known that earlier. Yeah. Yeah. So the kids usually sleep outside? Yeah. Oh, yeah. okay. Inside, well, they sleep here, the kids. Okay. The guest room, and the papa and mama room, the other side. Oh, wow, it is. Oh, yeah. it's huge. Yeah. I just do food here together, mm -hmm. and then they will separate. Okay, but okay. But the father will not do food with the ladies. Okay. Like his daughters. Why is that? You be kind of respect. So oh. uh, they just do, the ladies do just before father. Okay. They leave, then the dad do with his wife later. Oh, okay, okay. okay. Yeah. Miren, acá nos estaban explicando que... No cazan animales, sino que con, con el mismo trabajo de, de bisutería y de, y de madera que hacen, eso lo venden a los turistas y con eso pueden comprar comida y así cuidan a los animales y ellos no tienen que hacer eso. Antes sí lo hacían, pero ahora no. So, these different shops. Regardless yeah. of who sells, yeah, uh, yeah, they well, divide the money? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. cool. That's good. No importa quién venda, se dividen el dinero al final del día y con eso compran comida, etc. Tienen decoraciones. A decir verdad, las decoraciones que consigues en cualquier lado. Probablemente no vamos a comprar nada, pero... Aquí haciendo el paro de que estamos viendo. No, sorry. Tienen bastante... Sí, regalito. Así que bueno, está bien, es como una, es como una aldea, una tribu, se puede decir, moderna. Eh, 
Eh, está interesante, como él comenta ahí, pues algunos turistas se quedan aquí un día, dos días como para eh, ordeñar las vacas y tal, ver cómo comen, etcétera, y vivir como ellos. Así que, ah, está cool, está bueno. It has been a good experience. Thank yeah. you so much. Yeah. It's our first time doing something like this, so it's really, really nice to see how other people live. Bueno, hasta acá dejo el video. Así vive la gente en la en la tribu Masai africana. Me pareció bastante interesante. Comentarios. Super interesante. Super diferente a lo que uno está acostumbrado. Sí, todavía la gente vive así, que es lo más que es lo más increíble. Pero bueno. Hasta una próxima aventura.